And we will continue to follow that story as well for you throughout the day. Now, our other top story is a tragic story out of Hayward. Police say a 13-year-old girl and her dad were walking down the street with their two dogs when apparently one of those dogs sniffed at a passing man, and that man got so enraged, he pulled out a gun and ended up shooting the girl's father right in front of her. At this hour, the search is on for that gunman. It all happened near Vermont and B Street in Hayward about 10 o'clock last night. KTVU Channel 2 reporter Craig Devereaux has been talking with police about this and joins us very live with the very latest on this investigation. Good afternoon, Craig. Good afternoon, Claudine. This is about a horrible tragedy, as you can imagine. A Hayward man, a local man, doesn't live too far from the strip mall. Uh, near B and Kelly Hill comes down here late last night with his teenage daughter to buy ice cream and is shot and killed just after leaving. Police have identified the victim as this man, 38-year-old Thomas Cunningham of Hayward. Family provided this picture, which they say was taken about 14 years ago on his wedding day. A family member says Cunningham's 13-year-old daughter was visiting him for Thanksgiving. At about 10 p.m. last night, the 13-year-old Cunningham and two of his dogs came to a strip mall down the street at B near Kelly. Cunningham bought his daughter some ice cream, and they were all headed home. They were walking home, and one of the dogs uh, approached the suspect who was standing in the area and was kind of sniffing him, was not in an aggressive manner at all. The uh, suspect asked him to get the dog away. The daughter did so. The suspect and, and victim uh, had some kind of exchange of words, and the suspect pulled out a handgun and, and shot the man right in front of his 13-year-old daughter. Police say the suspect ran away on foot. There were several witnesses to what happened. The police say they called police. Cunningham was taken to Eden Medical Center in Castro Valley. His stepdaughter says Cunningham was pronounced dead about an hour later. She also says several family members had just spent a few hours with Cunningham at his home where he lives by himself. He was a good person and there was no, it was senseless. There's no reason for it. And, you know, this person is, he, he needs to be caught for ruining my family's, you know, just the rest of our lives, really. Store manager told me that Cunningham is a regular and stands out as a nice guy. His neighbors told me the same thing. Since there were witnesses, police say they do have a description of the suspect. They describe him as an African-American man in his early 20s, 5 feet 4 to 6 feet tall, slight build, and wearing a dark brown or black hooded sweatshirt. And I just spoke to the store owner again. He told me something else recently. He said that Cunningham came here for ice cream with his 13-year-old daughter, but the store was closed, but because he knew Cunningham, he let him back into the store. They came in, bought the ice cream, walked out, and a few minutes later, his daughter came running back, pounding on the glass door, asking him to call 911 because she says, I think my dad's been shot. Reporting live in Hayward, Craig Debro, KTVU, Channel 2 News. Thanks, Craig.